Croft. Have you had a good week? Good. The sun is shining again. Yay. Um, so hopefully I would have seen you on Zoom for our news and games and spotlight. But if I haven't and you've got some news, pause me and then go and tell someone in your house your news. Go. Okay. So let's kick it off with a treasure hunt game today. So I'm going to give you four different clues that you need to find. So um, your first thing that I want you to find is something that is made from wood. Something that is made from wood. Go! Well done! Okay, the next thing I want you to find is something that you turn on and off. Something that you can turn on and off. Go! Okay, well done! Now, Find something that you only use outside. Find something that you only use outside. Go! Okay, well done. Your final thing I want you to find is something that makes a noise. Find something that makes a noise. Go! Well done! Very good. Okay, so for our warm-up today, instead of doing our um, normal warm-up that we've been doing, I thought it might be fun if you guys created your own warm-up. So um, you can put on your favourite song and just get moving. So you can create something that you can teach to a family member or you can video yourselves doing it and then I can follow your warm-up. That would be really cool, wouldn't it? Um, so when you're doing your warm up, think about what parts of the body need warming up. So our feet, our legs, our hips, our arms and our shoulders, our necks, okay? So for your legs you could do our squats, you could do some lunges, you could do some bum kicks, some high knees, you could do some stretching and then we could roll our hips around, roll our arms, stretch. Okay, so anything that you like that gets your body warm. Okay, so have lots of fun with that and then um, once you've done that and you've had a quick drink, come back and we will do some drama. Drama time! Okay, so this week we are going to create some stories and drama scenes using the images that we roll on our story cubes. Um, so, remembering that our theme this term is summer, um, when you're creating your drama scenes and stories, try and think about that theme. So um, the setting for your stories could be somewhere summery, for instance. Okay, so let's begin. Okay, so these are your first cubes for your first drama scene. Can you see them? It's a bit of a reflection. But you have got um, paint brush and paint palette. 
you've got hopscotch you have got a I think it's like a scout um, you've got a rubber duck and you have got a boat a toy boat so you've got paints you've got hopscotch you've got a scout you have got a rubber duck and you have got a toy boat okay so try and make a drama scene out of those ones remembering the theme of summer yes okay next one okay can you see we've got a drum we've got a pair of shoes we have got some paints again we've got a bicycle and we have got a girl so we have got a drum some shoes some paint a bicycle and a girl okay Let's do one more. Okay. We have got a bat and ball. We've got jigsaw puzzle. We have got bubbles. We've got hopscotch. And we've got a yummy donut. So there's a bat and a ball, a jigsaw puzzle, bubbles hopscotch and a yummy donut okay so you end up with three stories or three drama scenes there remembering the theme of summer and then what you're going to do is um we're going to add to them and you will find out what we're going to do with them next okay so we have done our drama scenes or our stories with our um, drama cubes, story cubes. So now what I would like you to do is try and make a musical out of it. So you've got your drama scene, you've got your story. Now think about how you could add some dancing into it. So um, you could dance the whole story if you like, or you could act a bit of it out and then break into a dance with, with one of your favourite songs um, to help tell the story. And then once you've added some dance into it, I want you to add some singing. So you could sing the lines that you were acting out originally. You could turn them into a song or you could keep the, a bit of acting, then you could do a bit of dancing, then you might want to sing a song, then you might want to go back to some acting and so on. So whatever you feel would go with your musical and that would help tell the story. So you can, you can even make up your own songs if you want. So, Think about your favourite musical for inspiration, okay? So get your drama scene or story sorted, add some dance, add some singing, and put it all together, and I would love to see it, all right? So have lots of fun with that. Okay, so let's just finish off today with some breathing, okay? So we're gonna sit down, nice and quietly okay and we're just gonna do our breaths in and out we haven't done that for a while have we so we're gonna breathe in for four hold for four and we're gonna go out for six count okay so everybody breathe in two three four and hold two three and release two three four five six and again breathe in two three four hold two three four and release 
release. Two, three, four, five, six. Good, okay. And now we're gonna pick our favorite color. What do we want to glow in today? I'm gonna glow in yellow today because it's my favorite color and it's nice and funny, okay? So when we breathe in, imagine our color rising up, up into our heads and out the top and then it's glowing around and look at me, I'm glowing yellow, I'm like the sun. So now you can glow all day in your color and have a wonderful day. So I hope you've had fun with your lesson today and um, I cannot wait to see you guys next week. So if you haven't come on Zoom before, come and join us because it's really, really fun. And also, if you have any game ideas that you'd like to play on Zoom, write them down and then you can tell us over Zoom next time.